In case you didn't see my last video, the other day I actually flew my drone for the very first time, the DJI Mini 2. And uh, unfortunately, due to a combination of being a little overambitious, overconfident, extremely high winds, extremely low temperature, and a low battery, I ended up losing my drone uh, within about 20 minutes of taking off for the very first time. And uh, I was able to review some of the footage on my phone to get a rough location of where it was and was able to compare that footage with some Google satellite images. And I knew I had to retrieve it the next day because there was a blizzard coming in. Then I actually saw a comment on my first YouTube video about it saying that on the DJI Fly app, I could see the exact location where the drone landed, which was news to me. And I checked and sure enough, there it was on the map, just a little bit further south than I had thought. So I set out the next morning with my mom and brother to get it. And here's what happened. feels like negative eight degrees out. It's actually eight degrees. And hopefully we find it. All right, at this point, we're about a quarter to a third of the way down the river from where the spot is on the GPS where the drone should be. Uh, it's tough walking, a lot of frozen, half frozen wet ground bushwhacking. But it's so beautiful, let me show you. And that's my support crew you can hear back there. Hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> we are in the middle of freaking nowhere and still there's garbage but light look what i found here in the middle of nowhere <laughs> no it's bud light so it's not us you know one good thing about this is i never would have seen this if the drone hadn't gone this is beautiful oh, I know. could you stick this in the back of my backpack it's one of those things you'll never forget doing you know oh yeah that's how i kind of look at kind of things take you on a path you didn't expect. Unfortunately, my brother just took a bit of a tumble and totally soaked both feet inside of his boots. So he and mom are headed back to the car to get him warmed up because it's in the single digits right now. And uh, frostbite and hypothermia are a real thing. Thank you. So I'm forging on ahead because I'm still dry. I'm going to try to get this freaking drone a little over halfway there. According to <clears throat> the map on my Fly app, I should be pointed straight in the direction of where it is, which it looks like this, that direction. So let's see what happens. I'm going to make sure I don't step on it by accident. That would be pretty sad to go through all this effort and then step on it. Great. I was just bushwhacking through, and then bam, there she is. Right in the middle of all this shit. Oh, you little bastard, I got you. All right, let's see, oh God, let's see what kind of condition you're in. Oh wow, looks good. The rotors aren't even broken. Nice. Oh, thank God. All right, now all I have to do is make it safely back to the car without hypothermia or frostbite. Wish me luck. So I've retrieved the drone and I'm on my way back to the car and I feel like such a dumbass because I went into the trees and I found this beautiful trail, nice clean trail, dry, and we could have been walking on that and that would have saved us a lot of time and my brother wouldn't have gotten wet. So I feel pretty stupid, but I didn't know it was here, but I guess uh, we know for next time. So as you can see, it was mission success. The drone was recovered safely. In fact, I've got it right here. Here it is, still in perfect condition. It did have a little bit of frost and condensation on it when I got it. So when I got home, I put it in front of the radiator and put a high powered fan on it for about an hour just to dry anything out. 
And then I popped a fresh battery in and there you go. Still works. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to flying it again soon. And uh, this time I'm gonna go to a nice big open field, make sure it doesn't leave my sight, keep it low to the ground and actually go through the flight tutorial. I did pop the SD card out and found a little bit more footage than what was on my phone. So check it out.